Nick Lappy has done an unbelievable job, you know, all all year last year. It was an easy decision to put this guy on scholarship. Uh, you, know, you guys saw him on special teams last year. You're going to see him on defense playing linebacker. He can play probably any of the three positions. He's been athletic. He's tough. Um, and uh, the, guy that, the guy that's dependable. So, Nick Lappy, it's all yours. Thank you, Coach. All right. Nick, did Nick, you have uh, any inkling this was coming, that you were going to be put on scholarship? Um, yeah. I mean, at the end of uh, spring ball, me and Deuce uh, had a meeting. I think he does it with everyone. And uh, we talked about, you know, a battle between me and uh, some other guys. So, I, I had an idea. How were you informed? Uh, yeah, so it was in the, we, we had like a team meeting at the end of the day and we have like a senior speech. So uh, David Green, he had a senior speech and at the end he talked about like, he's like, what, what will, will it take to win a championship? And he talked about, you know, the Rocks, who's like our scout team. And he, he brought up uh, me and Brandon George talking about how we were on Rocks. And now we're on, you know, all phases of uh, special teams. And then uh, he was like, yeah, you know, those two guys, like, you know, scholarship guys. And I was like, I'm not on scholarship. And everyone was like, you know, talking a little bit. And then, and then Brandon was like, he was like, David, he's out on scholarship. And he's like, oh, that's right. You're on scholarship lap. And then, you know, all the, uh, you know, on the board, there's, you know, my face. <laughs> what was yeah. your family's reaction when you called <laughs> Well, yeah, I had to go in Doozy's office and call my mom. And uh, she was like, I mean, I can't say exactly what she said. She you know, cursed a little bit. <laughs> but, yeah, no, she, she was very happy. She couldn't stop smiling. So she's happy for me. What kind of weight is that off your shoulders, just knowing that that's, that's something that you achieved, that you set out for yourself? Um, I mean, not a whole lot. I mean, like, I'm not gonna, nothing's going to change. I'm just going to, you know, carry on. Like, what uh, Coach uh, Junk always said, you know, don't ever get too high, never get too low. Just keep sawing that wood. So I'm just going to keep doing that, keep working. You're in the middle of camp, so it might be hard, but have you been able to kind of reflect on your journey from where you started to where you're at? Um, yeah, yeah, definitely. I mean, I remember, like, freshman year, I was on, on rocks going against, you know, Kenny and, and Jordan Addison and those guys. So um, I definitely see a lot of improvement. Yeah, and I, I also think things started to really click last spring ball. That's when I started like understanding the defense and being a little more, you know, confident in our system. So what attracted you to Pitt in the first place? Because I'm sure you could have played at a smaller level and gone yeah. scholarships. So. I mean I just wanna, you know, come to a big school and, you know, stay a little close to, to home because I'm from yeah, New Jersey. So yeah.